So, usually when you try and do an image to 3D, it will usually messes up the tough areas like the hands, the face, the feet, you know. And these areas could take a while to fix, but if you're an actual 3D artist who even knows the basics of manipulating and editing 3D models, there's actually a really simple way to instantly fix most of your problems. Okay, is your mind and body prepared to receive the super secret professional solution to areas with trash topology? Okay? I will now bestow upon you the secret wisdom. When you receive areas with shit topology, delete them and replace them with things that have good topology. I mean, if you've been a 3D artist for a while, then you probably have hundreds of completed characters with good topology that you can just drag and drop. Or if you don't, you can go to TurboSquid or ArtStation or the Marketplace and find some free assets with good topology so that when the AI decides to screw up the hands, you can just replace them with good hands. Or if it gives you a bad face, you can just replace it with a good one. Seriously, just delete the part that sucks and replace them with parts that work. I've said this before, but I'll say it again. You Use tools where they make the most sense. You don't have to use one thing for everything. You know, the same way, like if you want the best textures, you're gonna use Substance. If you want the best effects, you're gonna use Houdini. If you want the best sculpting, you're gonna use ZBrush. If you want the best clothing, you're gonna use Marvelous. Like the same way that we use different tools for different specialties, if the AI is garbage at making hands, don't rely on the AI to make hands. Just get them from somewhere else. See, from my perspective, you want to spend your time doing the things that you enjoyed the most. If you like making characters, but you hate making environments, use the AI to make the environments. Like generate the trees and the bushes and the flowers and the mountains and everything else you don't care about. Or if you're the opposite, you're an environment guy who hates making characters. Use the AI to make simple rough drafts of the characters in the background and then kitbash the rest. Likewise, if you like making hand and feet but you hate making armor, use the AI to make the armor. That's really where I think this kind of stuff shines, especially if you're just doing this for fun. You can save a lot of time and headache by using tools to help with the things you don't like to do so you can instead spend your time on the things that you love. So don't get tunnel visioned on one tool or one solution. You can mix and mash different solutions together to get what you want. So I hope that helps. And as always, hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around.